enlightened for God to wash us. When we are rebuked, do you take it? Do we take it? Yes, that we have sinned. Or do we argue? We claim to be right. Thank God for Nathan. God used him to deliver David. Had he did not come, conf did not confront him, would have continued from one calamity to the other. And God used the man of God. Thank God for our pastor. God has used him to bring this program for us to cry for mercy, for God to purge us. Maybe we have done worse than David. The word of God says, he, he that hated his brother or sister is a murderer. This is the word of God. We can't argue the word of God. This is true. Do we see hurt, anger in our hearts? Maybe little misunderstand. Instead of us to forgive and just, we, we, we just start to build up things from nothing. May the Lord help us. Nothing is left to before the Lord God. Sin is sin. That's why we have gathered tonight. We, can, we, we cannot trust God. We pray we have faith in the Lord, we trust God. When our heart is not pure, no. It's our heart that will trust God. If our heart is not pure, our heart is not cleansed, we cannot trust God. And for us to have a clean heart, there are much benefits. There are rewards as children of God. For example, in Psalm 24, So who can I answer? Who can go to the, that hill? Say, so who has a clean hands? Pure hearts. Just paraphrasing. Who can be with our Lord? If our heart is not, not, our heart not clean, we cannot. We can't make it. We can't make it. So God wants our heart to be a repented heart. An acceptable heart. A heart that is pleasing unto him. That's the heart God is seeking for. So he can make his everlasting covenant. God is looking for the heart he will use, even at this moment. Are we going to make our heart available unto the Lord to be used? God cannot use us without us being cleaned. We can't not deceive ourselves. Say there are vessels of honor and dishonor. We want, we want to be vessels of honor. May the Lord help us in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God chose David. That's what he had done. Because there was something special in him. Is there anything special in him? God can say, you are my daughter. You, you daughter. You're after my heart. You son. My children. Is there anything? That is a repentant heart. He cried for mercy. He cried for mercy. He cried for mercy. He really cried with his heart, not with his lips. So we are going to cry tonight. Because God is looking for them that will draw near to him. When our heart is clean, then God with Thomas having a good heart or true heart. A clean heart is a whole heart. Why the bitter heart is a separated heart, separated from God. There's no connection. Whatever you might want to be doing now, that is hypocrisy. You don't want to live that life. You're going to cry. God has started doing his work. Yesterday, he, God used our beloved sister started the work. I know is 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 getting there. You no, know, God is doing something. Has started the good work. He began in us. He finished it in Jesus' name. Amen.
Thank you, my Lord. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Thank you, Jehovah Nisi. We're going to cry for, to God to forgive us, to wash us, to deliver us from sin, to deliver us. Hebrews 12, 22 says, let us draw near with a true heart. And say, call unto me, I will answer and show you great and mighty things. If our hearts not clean, God will, cannot answer our prayers. But we ask for mercy. And God is able to forgive us, to cleanse us. He's a compassionate God. Because we are not ignorant of our sins. We know that we are filthy. We have fed him. We have been disconnected. We have lost that first love. We are not more, we are no more steadfast to the faith we have professed. The Lord help us. The word of God said, when our heart is bitter, there will be no joy. Say, give me the joy, the new, the joy of your salvation. When our heart is bitter, where will be the joy? Where will the joy be? Where will you praise God? Even when you come in the presence of God, they will be praying and worshiping, but you will not be connected. They are just physically present, but spiritually and otherwise absent. You can't cheat it. That is spirit. Because something is wrong somewhere. We are just there, just as if someone is forcing us. But when our heart is clean, you don't even know whether you are one, two, or three. You are just focused. Because the word, that word of God is taking place in us. The man of God, David, despised the word of God and allowed flesh to lead him. I'm going to cry, Father, help me not to despise your words. Let me not to disobey. Help me. Not to disobey. The word of God said, let this word. Let us go to Colossians chapter 3, 16. Let it dwell in us richly. We need to pray. Father, let this word of God, we have accumulated a lot. We have accumulated. We are being fed. We are being fed. Colossians 3, 16. If you are there before me, you can. Colossians 3, 16, I read. Let the word of God dwell in you richly in all wisdom, teaching and admonishing one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing with grace in your heart to the Lord. Amen. God bless you, my dear sister. Let the word of Christ dwell in us richly in all wisdom. Let this word we are receiving dwell, dwell, dwell. That, that means relaxing in us and providing the food. Dwell in us richly. It's when the word dwells in us richly. Then we can, we, we, we can have wisdom. Where is wisdom coming from? It's from the fear of God. When the word of God dwells in us, we can teach. It's what you have, you can reproduce. If you don't have anything, what can we give? Is our heart not conducive? If the word of God is not dwelling, what can we give out? How can we admonish one another? Even some and him, they become like, what are they doing? You know? He said, and spiritual songs singing with grace in our hearts to the Lord. These things can occur when our heart is conducive. When our hearts are conducive. The Lord help us that this word of God will be receiving, studying, learning, them dwelling us so that the enemy will not have upper hand in our lives anymore, so that the flesh will be subdued, so we can live for our Lord Jesus Christ, the name of Jesus Christ. Finally, before we pray, let us go to Ezekiel chapter 36. Ezekiel 36, 
from 25, I read 25 to 27, I read in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Say, so then will I sprinkle clean water upon you, and you shall be clean from all your fitness and from all your idols. Will I cleanse you? 26. Said, a new heart also will I give you, and a new spirit will I put within you. And I will take away the stony heart out of your flesh, and I will give you an heart of flesh. Amen. And I will put my spirit within you, and cause you to walk in my status, and you shall keep my judgments and do them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our Father has promised us he will sprinkle, he will cleanse us because we have come. We have made this bold step. We have come to the Lord God. So he will sprinkle, he will clean us. He will purge us. We need the new spirit to renew us. To take away that stony heart. That heart of sin. Heart of wickedness. Heart of backbiting, heart of jealousy, heart of greediness, heart of hatred, don't forgive your heart. Adulterous heart. All kind of sins. But the sin originated from the heart. Out of the abundance of the heart, they must speak it. All those things. Heart is a powerhouse. Depend on the nature of our heart. Our character, our behavior relies on our heart, the state of our heart. A good heart, a clean heart, will reproduce a good attitude, good conduct. If our heart not clean, no. French said, Germain. I'm sorry, Dada Lucy, for borrowing. That's language. Hallelujah. It has a clean heart. It has a clean heart. It can produce. And God is seeking for them that worship him in truth and in spirit. If our heart is hearts are clean. My heart is clean. I worship God in truth and spirit. It's the controller of our lives. The name of Jesus Christ. We are going to pray. We are going to pray. In the name of Jesus Christ. We are going to pray. Oh Lord, my God. We are going to pray in the name of Jesus. We are going to pray. Oh Lord, my God, arise and let every fear of my heart and soul sink. In the name of Jesus Christ. We are going to pray in the name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. We are going to pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, my God, arise. Every feather of my heart, every feather of my soul, sing. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I rise in the name of Jesus Christ. I rise, my Father, I rise, my God, I rise, I rise, Lord of Lords. Let every feather of my heart sing. In the name of Jesus Christ, I rise, my Father, I rise, my God, I rise, I rise, Lord of Lords. I rise, my Father, I rise, my God, I rise, I rise, Lord of Lords. I rise, my Father, I rise, my God, I rise, I rise, Lord of Lords. Amen. Oh my God, guide my heart through this polluted world. As I commit into your into your safety arm in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh my God, guide my heart through this polluted world. 
As I commit it into your safety arm, in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh my God, my God, my heart, 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 my so that the Holy Spirit help me not to be stained by this God in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, my Father, my God, Holy Spirit of God, help me not to be stained, O God. Say, Lord, help me, Father, Lord. I cannot do this, O Father, O God, Lord. Help me to tell on you that I am not going to do this, O Lord. Help me not to be stained in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I cannot do this, O God. Let us be called in the name Hallelujah. Amen. We're going to pray. My father, please purify me, both inwardly and outwardly. Most outwardly Jesus. means fruit of repentance. Please, God, purify me, both inward. I don't want to be here purified mm -hmm. outside, like Most the Pharisees and Sadducees. So that's why God said, our Lord John can say, woe unto you, hypocrites. Outward, yeah, look good, but inwardly now, that's where the death, where the body is being led. We are going to pray, Father, purify me both inward and outwardly. In the name of Jesus Christ, I surrender my heart unto you. Purify I'm going to pray, you know, our ashes, like David. We're going to pray for it. Anyway, my actions and reactions has attracted anger, both physically or spiritually, even in homes or in the church of God. Our actions has most of our actions have caused many havocs in the body of Christ. Most people have left churches, left ministry because of one actions of one brother or sister. We are going to pray for the hard mercy upon me in the name of Jesus Christ. Anyone have killed spiritually. my Lord. Oh my God. 
Oh my God, strengthen my heart in loving you, no matter the situation, no matter the circumstance. In the name of Jesus Christ, strengthen mm -hmm. my heart in loving you. In the name of Jesus Christ, oh Lord, my God, strengthen my heart in loving you. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray with thanksgiving Amen. 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 Oh Lord, my God, deliver me from every spirit of covetousness and greediness. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. We are going to pray for God to give us the power to pray. Our Lord Jesus Christ started with prayer, ended with prayer. That was why he was able to overcome the temptation. He overcame. Without yes. that, we cannot overcome. We are going to pray, Father. Renew my strength in prayer, oh Lord. Release your power to us, oh God. Any power that has taken away from us, Oh God, give me the grace to overcome the trials and temptation of sin. Mm -hmm. Temptation will be there. The word of God said there must be there, but he said he will give us power. The one that is not common will not come to us. The one that we overcome will come to, will, will be there because the grace has been made available. Pray for the grace to overcome that trial and temptation of sin. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, my Lord. I pray for the grace of but I give me the Jesus Christ. We are going to pray, Father Lord, renew your covenant with me. That covenant the enemy has made to be broken. God mm. said, I will I will not break my covenant with David. Covenant mm. in God. Ah. Mm. Unless, unless the sun or the darkness will break, unless you know that 
God said he will not break. We are going mm. to pray, Father. Any covenant, oh Lord, the enemy has caused us, oh Lord, to be broken. Father, renew that covenant with you, Lord. Renew mm. our covenant with you. Oh Lord, deliver me from every slavery abundant of sin and of faithfulness in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, deliver me from every slavery abundant of sin and of faithfulness. Mm. In the name of Jesus, we're going to pray the same prayer again. But they just see, they see you see yourself, say, this is why. Tomorrow you see yourself committing it again. After mm. praying, you see repeating, start stubborn sin. We are going to pray like this. Mm. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, Lord, my God, deliver me from every stubborn sin in my life. Oh, that stubborn sin that doesn't want you to go to heaven. Oh, Lord, today I commit myself unto your hand. Deliver me, oh God. In the name of Jesus Christ, oh God. Deliver me, oh God. Oh, 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 Amen. Oh Lord, wash me and cleanse me with high soap that I will be whiter than snow. We want to be whiter than snow. Father, wash us and cleanse us with high soap that we be whiter than snow. In the name of Jesus Wash me, Baba, from all my iniquities. In the mighty name of Jesus, Jesus. 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 Jesus.
in Jesus' name. Hey, mm. that means every flesh, every spirit of self pleasing. Father, Lord, mm. put it. Put it in my life. Thank you, my God. Thank you, my Father. Restore to me the joy of your salvation, Lord. Restore unto us, God. Restoration and joy of my in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord, use me to reach out to those who need forgiveness and reconciliation. Use us to reach out those. It's where our hearts are clean. Then God can use us. My Lord, use us, Lord. In the mm. name of Jesus. Lord Jesus. To reach out to Lord. Lord. Those who need forgiveness and reconciliation. Use us, my Lord. Use us, my righteous one. Use us, Jehovah, this. Use me, Father. In the name of Jesus. Use us to reach out to Lord. Those, my Father, Lord. That need reconciliation. In the name of Jesus. That need forgiveness. In the name of Jesus, 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 and mm. with the heart of flesh. Yes. In the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. This heart of stone, the heart of flesh, Lord, my Father, take away this heart of stone. Jesus, I'm going to give you a call. 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 I'm Oh, 
Father, we thank you like you for answering our prayers. Father, thank you for thank you for you for God. Thank you, we thank you for loving us more. We thank you, my Lord. Thank you, my Lord. I 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 thank you, Father, we thank you, we bless your holy name, we worship you. Papa. Thank you for the grace, thank you, Lord, for your word tonight. Thank you for the ministration. Thank you for filling us tonight. Thank you for renewing us, Lord. Thank you for your mercies towards us, Father, Lord. You're a merciful God indeed, my Lord, my Father, Lord. Father, we thank you, Lord, for hacking onto our cry tonight, oh Lord. We exalt your holy name forevermore in the name of Jesus Christ. We are being the blood of Jesus cover our prayers and answer prayers and every accuser of brother that will rise against us. Let the blood of the Lamb arise and rebuke them in the name of Jesus Christ. We call us all our spirit and mind the blood of Jesus Christ. So God, this ministry in the blood of Jesus Christ, our beloved brother that couldn't make it as men that watch that will watch later, Father Lord. We call their hearts of God. May you cleanse us, oh Lord. The body of Christ and Lord, cleanse us, my Lord, my Father Lord. So at last, oh God, we all will be where you are in the name of Jesus Christ. Jesus. Help us, Father Lord. It is not by our own power. It is not by our might. It's by your spirit, oh Lord. It's by your grace, Lord. We have called mm -hmm. upon your holy name. You say, I call you, you will answer us. And you will show us greater and mighty things. Yes, which we Lord. do not know, Father. We have called tonight in faith to you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. I will believe that you've answered us, oh Lord. That you've mm -hmm. answered us and cleansed us from all this unrighteousness. And it's continue to do more of your work in our lives. Be that glorified forevermore. For in Amen. Jesus Christ's mighty and powerful name, we pray thanksgiving. Amen. 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 Hand over to you, my sister. Amen.